Hey, Shalom, Shalom, this is the brother, my Aquadar, back with his truth. Want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Rakah, Padas. I would like to give double honors to our apostles and elders of Great Millstone that we will, and blessings to you, brother, that's pushing his word and truth and sincerity around the four corners of the earth, risking your lives and freedom to do so. All right, to you, I say Shalom. All right, and um, the spirit jumped back on me to uh, redo this video. All right, so hey, man, Yahweh right desire. All right, it goes up and uh, be edifying. All right, and it says uh, Edomite woman caught on video calling so-called black woman an uh, N-word. Says she's not sorry and will do it again. The North Carolina woman claims she wasn't racist despite refusing to apologize and insisting that she will use the racist slur again. All right, so hey, man, like I said, man, these uh, red Hebrew Edomites, all right, they have a perpetual hatred towards us that the scriptures speak about, man. And when you go into that word perpetual, it means uh, never ending. All right, when we are in the kingdom, Akim, all right, these Edomites are going to hate us still. They're going to have that perpetual hatred towards us, man. That's why after serving a thousand years hard bondage, man, the Lord has to exterminate them. All right, so we're going to play this video and, uh, you know, your Howard Rock design, man, it'd be edifying. shows an encounter between customers at the Bonefish Grill in North Hills. This person has the audacity right here to come to our table and tell us that we are the rudest people that she has ever met. Look at Then the woman, who we now know is Nancy Goodman, calls another customer the N-word. You're too loud. We're too loud. Your in your opinion. Let me show you my money. It's just as green as yours. Right. Oh, you're so stupid. at her home. I'm a 71 year old woman who lives in Raleigh. I suffer from tremendous anxiety. She says that anxiety and the women's behavior pushed her to act as she did. I'm not going to say I'm sorry to them because they put, kept pushing at it. So, And that's all I'd really like what to say. What about your use of the N-word? I used that word because they forced me into it. Do you see how that's incredibly offensive? Yes, I do. That's why I said it. I would say it again to them. She says she would use that word again to you all. Wow. Wow. That's sad. Shonda Stewart is the one who took the cell phone video. Her friend, Lakeisha Shaw, is the one who was called the racial slur. I don't care how you feel like we should have been acting. If I was standing on the table with three heads in a purple jumpsuit, nothing justified you to come to my table and call me a stupid. Goodman says she regrets not asking management to tell the women to be quiet, but she made one thing clear. So you're not Thank sorry you. about saying the N-word? No. No. So she basically just All right, and before we get into this, uh, you know, I do want to throw phone on airplane mode. And uh, I got a quick scripture, all right? This is uh, Psalms, the 44th chapter. Uh, I'm going to start at verse 13. It says, Thou makest us a reproach to our neighbors, a scorn, and a derision. All right, which derision, like ridicule, the, hey, the things that uh, these devils uh, say about us <laughs> to our face and behind our back. To them that are round about us. Hey, right along with the rest of these heathens. All right, say, thou makest us a byword among the heathen, a shaking of the head among the people. All right, because here it is, you know, you know, hey, the nigga woman's, all right, they probably was, you know, being loud. And you know how those nigga women's come in uh, the spirit of ratchetness, as they call it. All right, and uh, either my woman asked them, they, you know, they all too loud, man, which, hey, man, you know, to each his own, man. You know, she don't have a right to tell someone else they're too loud, man. But uh, no one wants to go amongst ratchetness, man. All right? 
And, um, you know, she said y'all too loud. And, you know, the first thing the nigga woman say is, uh, let me show you that my money is just as greener as yours. And that's when the Edomite makes the comment. <laughs> All right. And that's why these women supposed to be in order, man, up under a man, man. And that's why our nation's supposed to be coming back to your high boy Shimei Shah, all right? Coming back to our ancient culture, man, to conduct yourself like an Israelite, man. All right? Because if you don't conduct yourself as an Israelite, you are going to be a shaking of the head amongst the people around about you. Period, man. Period, man. All right, so that's all the, uh, you know I wanted to uh, say, man. And uh, with that, man, I want to say shalom.